Uh, Pete here with a uh, update on Divi Ajax Filter 1.3. This is a video just to show you some of the features we've added. We thought it will be more useful just to show you a video as well as text, but uh, just so you get an idea of what's going on. So we've added some things. Uh, the first thing we've added is uh, conditional filters. So this is, for example, if I click on this color gray, it will then show another filter called product rating. However, if I click on all, it will then show none. It won't show that product rating filter. So this is, you can control to uh, the visibility of filters based on other settings. There's a video which goes into more detail about this in the description below. The second thing we've added is displaying categories. So there's several ways you can display your categories now. The first one is to display only parent categories, which you can see here. The second one is to only display subcategories of a parent category that you define. For example, if I want to show only the subcategories of clothing, I can do this. Next one is to show all the subcategories of the current category. So if I'm on the clothing categories page, it will show me all the clothing. If I'm on the music uh, categories page, it will show me all the subcategories of music. Lastly is to show all the categories. And finally, actually, so not lastly, finally, there's conditional categories. And this is, for example, if I click on clothing, you'll see it will update with another filter below based on the subcategories of clothing. Or if I click on music, it will then populate with the subcategories of music. If I click on decor, for example, there are no subcategories, so it will just filter the products automatically. So, for example, here, if I click on clothing and then accessories, you'll see it will then show me the accessories so there's another video about more about that so uh, don't yeah so please watch that video as well next thing we've added is uh, let me just reset this next thing we've added is uh, the, the, the to limit the heart of your radio options so you can see here there's a show more click on that it shows more or I can show less this is really useful when you have a long list of radio fields to do that, go to the theme builder, click on settings, go down to your one. I'm going to do color. In the checkbox radio filter options, scroll down to limit the heart of your radio checkbox filters. Enable that, set a max heart, change the text, change the icon, position the icon. You can also change the text, font, and color of the show more font or show less font save that and it'll do what you want the other thing we've added is uh and actually i haven't actually checked how it looks on mobile okay so you can see it shows all on mobile we've added an option as well in the filter post module scroll down to the mobile options in here you can toggle whole filter which you see in the last update now you can toggle individual filters. Enable that. Let's see what happens. Reload this page. So you can see, I can now toggle them individually on mobile. Furthermore, on the mobile options, I can toggle the whole filter with a button and also make it auto close when filtering. So I'm going to enable both of those options and you will see what will happen now. Let's reload this page. Okay, filter. Obviously, you can make this look better. Start it up. If I click on that, it will expand. Then I can click on that. Click on decor. Scrolls down. I mean, I can fine tune the position on the scrolling and it also closes the filter. So where you can fine tune actually the auto scroll is over here. So you can see how I can auto scroll from the top. I can change the position. So don't worry the in that example. Don't worry the way it went down. But you can see how the filter closed closed when we fil when we filtered. Okay. So other than that, we've changed. You know, we've made we've improved things, made smaller minor modifications. But those are the kind of the, the, the main the main updates that we wanted to show you. 
We hope that you like it and we hope that you continue to make awesome websites. Have a great day and speak to you soon.